Yo, 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 it's Big Ant, the spokesman, man. We back, another edition of Urban Politicians TV, UPTV. Make sure you stay on your pivot at all times, man. I got one of the Texas legends in the building, Trap. Hey, my boy, what's Big that Trap, man? Trap Boy Freddie, man. I done broke a sweat trying to get everything set up in here, but we cool, though, man. It's all worth it, man. But, uh, nah, bro, I ain't never really seen you just pop. I know you come out here and tap in and do your yeah. thing and work and stuff like that in ace time but you know to have you up here in 2023 to start the year off is dope bro oh no nah, yeah 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 for sure man i'm fine and just getting back out moving and grooving real quick mm, for sure for sure uh you still do i seen earlier this year too man you started off in the gym you still up in there or you to get you to fail yeah, back and yeah, fell yeah. off already now nah, we in the gym heavy man we even working out down here there's no days off <laughs> grind i got a bet to win you know? oh you made a bet chasing that money now <laughs> <laughs> nah for real for real nah man you one of the pillars in texas man for this generation for sure uh undeniable and one thing i like about your grind and your name because i came to you through the internet you know what i'm saying yeah. Uh, I can't remember exactly what year, man. I know I used to see you on Gutter TV a lot back in the Gap, doing the in the hood, the little vlogs, and seeing you on different little things online and everything, man. And I was always checking you out, even when you put y'all was putting just certain a whole new vibe together because you know Dallas had the Houston scene, the the club scene on like through like the boogie and the dance vibes and all that. Yeah. But y'all brought the little fly kind of hood street culture and everything like that to the game for niggas out there because we didn't really get to see a lot of that with Dallas unless you was out there. Yeah. So y'all brought that flavor with the music with what you had going and uh, Yellow Beezy most definitely for me. I can't speak for nobody else, but for me, y'all put that image out there for me with the shag and the, yeah. the fly, being fly with it, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, for sure. So, uh, nah, man, you got, for my people, this your first time on my platform. I want to take them back through the beginning, man. Oak Cliff real quick, you know, coming up out there, bro. What's that whole uh, vibe and energy like, man? I mean, you know, it's just like survival of the fittest, baby, you know. In yeah. the jungle, that's where it's at. Yeah. You know, I love Oak Cliff. Oak Cliff's cool money, though, you know. Yeah. You, you cool, dude. You can make it through there. You know, ain't nothing too good, too bad, you know. It's just normal, you Yeah. Know? Yeah. Nah, for sure. Uh, I seen, uh, like, out here in Ace Time, that's all we used to hear at first was Oak Cliff, Oak Cliff. Everybody from Dallas would work, uh, rep Oak Cliff that I would come across, and I'd be like, damn, is the whole Dallas Oak Cliff or something like that at one point? <laughs> so, uh, nah, bro, you coming up out there, you know, what What made you jump into the game of like, hey, bro, I got to go ahead and try this rap stuff too? I mean, we was already popping it super hard yeah. on some looking like rappers, you know. Mm -hmm. So everybody like, man, you need to rap, you need to rap, you need to rap. So mm -hmm. I went ahead and started rapping. But really, I wasn't even going to rap. My buddy was rapping, and okay. I just came and came right behind him doing it type shit, you know, because a nigga invested in it. So I tried to get that money back up out of it. Okay. But other than that, I I was gonna, I, I would have rapped, but it's more so, more so like the lifestyle. Okay, okay, the image, the culture, the, the, the grinding and trying to get it. Yeah, we was already shining, so yeah. might well make some money off of it. For sure, for sure. Now, you coming up early out there, bro, you kind of grew up a little hard, though, huh? Like, Yeah. Nah. Yeah, yeah, nah, for sure, for sure, man. And, and I like to see, like, everything you done been through, you done stuck with this music stuff even to this day. What be making you feel like, bro, I got to keep going? Because it seemed like at times... Things could be backed up against you, but I don't never see you like say, man, you know what? I quit or I'm done. It's like you just face everything that's I coming. Mean, it's like it's two things. You yeah. Know? The main, 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 main thing is I don't put so much money in it. Okay. You know, so that's number one. But okay. immediately after that is because everybody want me to stop, so I ain't gonna stop. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like right after that, like I ain't gonna stop just just cause I make other people mad or something, I'll keep doing it. Okay. Is that like an ego thing, or is that like something just for yourself? Like, I mean, nah, that's just like personal, you know what I'm saying? They mad, make them matter, you know what I'm saying? Some shit yeah. like that, but yeah. I damn sure go put it in their face every nah. time I get it. Nah, for sure, man. And I remember one song you had dropped that tape with a dear father on there, bro. Yeah. When you dropped Dear Father, I was sitting there to my homies, and you had the freestyle on that. That was like 2018. Yeah. That was around the same time. Was that 2017 or 2018? I can't remember. It might have been 18. I think that's Trap Boy, Freddy Cougar 3. Yeah, Freddy Cougar 3. So when you dropped that, that's when I kind of was just getting started to do YouTube. Yeah. So that's why I was really checking that one out. 
And that song, Dear Father, really just stuck out to me at that time. And I had it on repeat it, repeat in the crib, cooking breakfast to it, yeah. eating to it. And I was just letting that tape run back and forth because at first I couldn't really understand everything. And then that one right there made me say, okay, I got to respect everything he got going. Y'all was already doing everything y'all had going in Dallas and everything like that. But that's the one that really made me say, you know what? Okay, I'm rocking with Trap now. Nah. And that was just me getting to learning how to do the shit. Okay. Now, I already knew the business, but that's me getting to learning melanies, learning the flow, learning. Okay. Now, I smoke that. Nah, for sure. So I smoke that. For sure, for sure. So, uh, you and Yellow, man, how you and Yellow, Yellow came together, man, for my supporters who don't know and everything like that? That's my dog. You know, we just mingled and met out through Oak Cliff and shit like that, but yeah. we grew tight through, like, this music shit and shit like that, you know what I'm saying, but... That's my dog. Yeah, yeah. Nah, y'all two always popping out, making Dallas look good with the yeah. this lifestyle, the culture, the image, you know. See how y'all rock with it. And I like to see niggas from the city tapping in and getting they shine on, bro, because I feel like this is all big Texas at the end of the day. Yeah. I mean, niggas who know who watch me, that's what I be on. Like, man, get y'all money, get fly, live y'all life, take care of y'all family, man. And I like how you and Yellow be putting that together and making it, you know what I'm saying, look good in Texas for sure. Heavy on Texas, heavy on Texas. And uh, nah, man, so you you been kicked off this year going dumb, going crazy with it, bro. So, uh, you know, and you the artist that I see a lot of the time really rock with the upcoming new artists in the game. Oh, yeah, forever. Yeah, so what What part, what is in you to make you feel like, okay, I see a nigga coming up? Because you was a nigga that's consistent and it's undeniable that's, hey, this young hot artist in Dallas, this young hot artist in Fort Worth, yeah. that hot artist, no like, weird stuff about it. Hey, let's get on here. Let's shoot the video and all. Yeah, we're going to do all that. I mean, I just know how it feel, you know, from needing assistance or wanting assistance or, yeah. you know, just recognition and some shit. You know what I'm saying? So I know how folk a hold their nuts on you. And if, if if I see you taking it serious, you know what I'm saying, I'm going to fuck with you. you okay. I ain't going to even slow you down. Cause I know that shit going to help you or get you where you need to go. And I might need you one day. Yeah. Or however the case may be, you know, allies. Everybody need allies. But yeah. beyond that, you know what I'm saying? If you taking it serious and you really want to do this rap shit, I'm gonna pull you with the rap shit because I didn't never care about the rap. So yeah. I get somebody who like it or love it or yeah, yeah. man, come on, let's do it. Yeah. Long as you for real, I'm fucking with you. Yeah. Just don't waste my time. You know what I'm saying? Don't put me in no bullshit spots. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> nah, for real. Nah, I see you get in there. Like, I know uh, Kevin got bands and several other artists. Yeah. Man, you like, you be everywhere with it out there, man. That's why I be liking to see, bro. And I hate that at times it seems like it's a pushback out there, bro. Yeah. Uh, just like, okay, let me go with him. Let me not rock with him. And there's a nigga from, tech, from Ace Time. I look at that like back in the day when I was a young nigga growing up. That's what messed up our wave. Yeah. So how you feel about the DF dub rap scene right now, bro? I mean, you know, everything coming back together, bro. Everybody just got to, you know, just work, grind. Yeah. But, you know, I know it's a, it was a bunch of bumps in the road, so yeah. niggas just got to get over speed bumps, you know, certain shit. People mm -hmm. got to build certain relationships, build certain trust up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But as a whole, you know what I'm saying, it's going to get where it need to go. It yeah. might take a little minute, it might be short, ain't no telling, but if everybody go hard and don't worry about it, you know what I'm saying? Nothing else. Yeah. It'll be back for it. Because right I, I, I go out there, nigga, and I get love. Like, you know what I'm saying? Even like from you when I hollered at you at South by Southwest, and I know I do the media shit, and that shit get messy. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, man, let me holler at this nigga. I'll be fucking with dog. You know what I'm saying? And then yeah. when I went up to you, it was love. Uh, we was at one of them little spots out there. I was like, oh, this nigga a cool nigga. For sure, you was in there rocking with the people once again. Uh, kicking it with your people, just chilling. You know, yeah. people can come holler at you and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm so, with it. Nah, I, 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 I like how a nigga can really get out here and touch certain people, bro, on some, like, real player, cool, genuine stuff. And even you pulling up for this interview for sure, man. Yeah. So uh, you being in this rap game, man, what's one, one of the hardest things you'd have had to deal with for niggas who don't know, bro? Uh, You know, I done had a few options. Bro, but yeah. see, you know, just one on the business side, you know what I'm saying? Like something like, hey, bro. I mean, business wise, yeah. it's like me. I'm a fast worker, you know what I'm saying? I work real fast. I done dropped 20 tapes mm -hmm. my whole career. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Three of them since I've been signed. Mm -hmm. And I probably got signed in like 2019. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. 
the um, the probably the biggest thing is like now I can't just drop when I want. It gotta be everything gotta be wrapped up right and tight. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I used to could just jump in that water, gotcha. and let them catch on the two three songs and keep on and get two off this song off this tape and this tape. You know what I'm saying? But now you gotta slow it down and really put thought into it. Mm-hmm. And I ain't really no slow grinder. Yeah. It's cool though. You know what I'm saying? I adjust with the shit. So it is what it is. But that. Yeah. That's not even a problem. That's just an adjustment. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I don't have no problem business wise. Yeah, I mean, it's just the rap world. Yeah, just trying to get it understood yeah. and laid out correctly. Cause now nah, it do be a certain way you got to push it and make it roll like. Cause I know like that independent scene in y'all region, y'all niggas just dropping crazy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Video after video, whenever you feel like it, it don't matter who, whatever, we drop it on this channel, our channel, like da 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 da. That's the game, man. Yeah. I think that consistency would make niggas like just gotta respect it. Consistency. Yeah. When that once they know you for real, man, they gonna all right, let me find a check you out, bro. Yeah. Like, oh, then you doing say something good, they gonna stick with you. That's that's the game. Gotcha, gotcha. But so, you can slow grind it in. Like Yella, Yella had a slow grind, but it wasn't slow, but he slowed with the CDs, and it was all smoke, and they grabbed on him quick. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's like a, it's, it's, it's different artists that did shit like that, but then you got the Gucci man ground where Gucci dropped a thousand CDs. Nah, for real. You get what you get or whatever, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. It did, you know, it's it's different, different stroke for different folk, but it yeah. can be done. Yeah. Did you ever uh did you ever get the link with Gucci Mane in Dallas? Nah, I ain't, I mean we done linked up. I yeah. met the nigga and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? But we yeah. never did no rapping or nothing. Okay, because I know that nigga used to stay in Dallas, man, when he like had the buzz like doing the shows, it seemed like. Nah, I went to all the shows and shit, but I yeah. on a personal tip, you know, so I was gambling at the casino with him and shit. Okay. Like that. What that was like, bro. <laughs> Man, that was my first time ever seeing him in the evening. Yeah. Trap well. Now, nigga, nigga knew me. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Long Way. You know what I'm saying? He's like, yeah, you fuck with Long Way. Okay. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? That, that was a cool vibe right there. We both lost that day, but yeah. that was cool. Nah, that's hard, though, because a lot of niggas, I know they'll do the little fly shit and just act like they don't even know who he is, but. Nah, what real nigga? Yeah. Nah, that's what's up. That's what's up. So you like tap in, too, with the people, bro. That's what. I know too, like you you don't mind like venturing out of Texas and rocking with niggas, bro. I'm I'm with I'm with the money. I don't damn about all that. For sure. Nah, that'd be hard, bro. And uh the cool money and entertainment thing, man, for the people that don't know, like, where you wanna take that to, bro? Shit. To the goddamn bank. Yeah. But you know, everywhere, you know, we trying to go big on big. Goddamn, we trying to, like, like Bird say, he looked to Jay Prince and all that. I'm up trying to go cash money on these folks. For sure. Straight up. Yeah. Now, I can see the energy, man. I can see you taking it serious because, like, it's like, really, bro? In these last few months, it's like you've been more serious than ever, dog. Like, even like I seen the thing you went up there and did with a uh, famous animal. Yeah. And, you know, you you said a line on that. You was like, man, my uh, mama told me respect everything with a heartbeat. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I was like, dang, this nigga really be. Yeah, nah, that 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 was some goddamn. I had some time that day, you know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. fucking with it. That, that's no distractions. We got to cut out all the bullshit. And yeah. We got tunnel vision right now. And yeah. We finna just go with our move. Nah, nah, for real. I rock with that because it's like you'll get on the songs and talk some real deep stuff at times, and I think people kind of overlook that with you, bro, and try to, like, box him out, like, Trap ain't saying this. So he ain't. I'm like, nah, nah, you got to listen to bro. He really be talking, man. Yeah, they got to pay attention, you know. It's, it's, you know, it's different. Yeah. Different plays for different days, man. For sure, uh, for we sure. We're going to get them, though, one way or the other. It's cool. Nah, nah, it's on the way for sure, man. So, uh... Also, bro, Ace Time, man, since you out here, bro, did you come up in there and, like, listen to that Ace Time music early on, or you was kind of more so, like, on your own little thing? Yeah, I, mean, I wasn't listening to no music and shit like that, because yeah. I, I wasn't really no music type of nigga. Gotcha. You know what I'm saying? But, man, I used to stay out here, though. Oh, you used to stay out here? Yeah, I got half my family in, in, in goddamn Yeah, never knew that. Yeah, for sure. Okay, nah, that's what's I, up. I used to come to Houston. I, man, I used to be in Houston all the time. Nah, for sure, for sure. Nigga yeah, never knew they, that. 
Never knew that. Never knew that. So, uh, yeah, man, what we got coming now, bro? What's next up, man, for the year, bro? Like, no tape, no what, man? What we got going? I mean, I'm whipping up some shit right now, but I don't even got a name for it. You know what I'm saying? But okay. I'm coming super hard. We on some goddamn 2025 shit. We way ahead of the game. Yeah. Goddamn, we, uh, I'm going to drop some more visuals off my last tape. You know, I did 13 songs, eight videos already out off of it. Yeah. Probably drop like three, two more videos or some shit, and then we're going to roll out the next tape. Yeah, nah, this is going to be dropping the videos, man. Y'all got to tap in for sure, bro. Yeah, nah, we working. Nah, hey, and I got to salute Trap, man. This nigga here really be pressing it, going against the odds and beating the odds every time something go against them, bro. Because sure. it be a game out here or just... They get negative for all the rappers now, bro. Like, yeah. it seemed like the negativity in the rap game is just, like, at an all-time high just in the media, bro. Like, uh, uh, uh. It's a love-hate thing, man. They love you, they hate you, they love you, they hate you, they love you again. Yeah. You know, it's, it's just like, you know, you're going to do something somebody dislike, you're going to do something they like again. For sure. That's all the deal. Nah, nah, man. I rock with Trap. How you doing this shit, though, man? That's 100, bro. Hey. Tell them what we got going with a tap in with you. And if they don't know, man, for sure. Hey, man. Trap Boy Freddy everywhere. Go on my YouTube. We running my YouTube up right now. Go get that no distractions out everywhere. Yeah. Distractions, you know what I'm saying? That's the latest two things. But yeah. no distractions. Y'all pay attention. We're going to get bigger. We're going to get better. Yeah. Whole bunch of old clips shit. Whole bunch of cool money. Whole bunch of Texas. Yeah. Long live the guys, baby. And when you say and when you say no distractions, bro, what do you say this biggest distractions out here be for niggas, bro? I mean, you know, you know, got rap beef. Rap beef is the biggest distraction in the world. Got you. But that ain't the big. I mean, it's the biggest, but that's the smallest. You got the streets is a distraction. You got a lot. Women is a distraction. You know, it's a lot of distractions. Bro. Mm. Dice is a distraction. Gambling, you know what I'm saying? It's, yeah. It's a lot of things that can get you off track. Well, you just gotta pay attention and stick to the strip. Stick to the script, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Go by the playbook. Nah, for sure, man. Tap in, Trap Boy Freddy. Do, keep doing it, man. Going up, Dallas, Oak Cliff in the building. We rocking for sure, bro. Gotta know it, baby. Uh -huh.